to the mainstream now. There, there we go. Oh, hey everyone, and welcome aboard. I'll be a Captain Hillian tonight, along with Free Assembly Lieutenant Drakir at your service. And welcome back to Ori and the Will of the Wisps. I think I said it about right this time. I, whenever I you know, say that, it's like I'm trying to lure a cat by that. And hello there, Marco. You doing well still today? Uh, what? What did he? Say? Don't forget something. Cheater or what the heck is he right there? Uh, yeah, if that's some sort of rank or position on a ship, I don't know it, Marco. And that's good to hear. It. Uh, yeah, this is our third stream of this. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this stream was a bit at risk because we were my my family was planning or at least wanting to go out for dinner today, but uh, yeah, as obvious, it didn't come to that. So uh, we get to continue with the uh, Ori. Yep. Oh. No, it's if we can say shat shatter. I think you'd need a second T for that, but I don't think that's a, an accurate ish word for that, Marco. Passenger would be more likely. Anyways, last time well who got hurt after Ori went into the silent woods to go look for her. But they ran into Shriek. And they aren't dead, but they are dying. So, yeah. Let's see. Moki needs a home, uh, house for his home. Talk to Grom to see. Yeah, well, that is something we can't. Did we do that? Or... Mm -hmm. Hmm. Okay, I must have done something because we're low on Gorlek ore. <coughs> Anyways, let me double check. Oh, yeah, we need to go find th three wisps to well try and revive the local spirit tree. Yeah, so, and yeah. I think I remember what you did last time while you were missing some ore. <laughs> yeah, we built something. You built the homes. Let's specifically let's mm -hmm. double check. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we did, we prepared the dwellings. Oh, so more housing. Yes. Hmm. Okay, do we need to build the more one, or... Let's see. Are you afraid of spiders? Yeah, I've never seen one, but I would be very afraid if I did. I hear there are many spiders in the moldwood... Uh, in the moldwood depths. It is good that a guardian of stone keeps them trapped inside. Totally not foreshadowing. Never seen a spider before, okay? Let's see. Grom has built a good hut, and a good hut makes a good home. If you go east, could you tell my family I have found a new home? They live in the silent woods, in the first hut near the entrance. I will pay for the help. And here, you might need this key. The woods are not safe, not anymore. You're lucky to have... <laughs> Had your family be able to survive in there with Shriek going around. Okay, hot key. And yeah, family reunion. Family reunion, not reunion. Anyways, rebuilding the glaze. Yeah, there's more of here. It's a long term quest for now. Uh, let's go over here. Or is this... That, uh, when the willow died, the wisps of its light were scattered across the land. Find the wisps in Bower's Reach, Moldwood Deaths, and Luma Pools, and heal the land of Nguyen. Okay, this is just where we need to gather them up. Uh, let's see. How do we get to those areas at the moment there? Lost in... Ah, uh, okay, so they are shown. There's one. There is one. And there is one. Okay. So how do we get there? There's an opening I can see here in unexplored territory. I can't see anything that would lead to there from here. This is the windmills or the water wheels, the mills internals. 
Uh, let's see, Marco. I also tried Bastion. It's a good game. Yeah, it is. <laughs> the, re the narrator will react differently to things if you do them differently. Like, I believe if you hang around at the start, you will li he will mention that. <laughs> Okay, you you could probably also get some different lines out of him if you don't kill off some of the beasts once the uh, entrance is open to reward to the actual uh, sky warp. For now, if I are, oh, we were only equipped with the bow because the bow was the only thing that Ori could use uh, <clears throat> whilst riding Ku around. Okay. Over here and then the up. Mm -hmm. I am kind of curious and hope that we'll make new games based in this uh, universe. Yeah, that would definitely be nice. Oop, it is a very I... damn pretty universe. Yeah, okay. and it has a lot of room to grow. Like, I'm up for another old game, but also okay with another new hero root here in the set in the same universe yeah there's plenty of other spirits that the uh, uh, wrong uh, which one was it again to bash did, did i say that right hero and heroine about yeah like it's always annoying that the word for female hero is is very close to a drug yeah. Mm. yeah I, hello there. I really oh, use that word due to I always fear to mispronounce it to the order. Okay. I think I have sometimes just said a uh, female hero just to avoid that. Yeah, I, I believe the spelling is basically the same, it's just how you say it that makes the difference. Yeah, actually, actually, it is slight different spelling. For I think one, one is spelled with an E at the end, and one, the other one that is the drug, I think is spelled without the E at the end. Hmm. Not too sure. It's more it's the fine. more the symbols on the letters that's supposed to signify that it's emphasis or something or inflections. I don't know. I should look it up sometime. Yeah, uh, is, 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 is it really easy? It's Swedish. It's Swedish. Also, see it. See you another time, <laughs> then, uh, Marco. Oh, we, we say Marco. Oh, I should both laugh. Right. In Swedish, we say Yelte or Yeltina. Heroin. And if you say the drug heroin, we just say heroin. Okay, and so, those are some evil looking clams. So yeah, if you were to speak to me in Swedish, I would probably say Yeltina, since, well... Yeah, you hear yourself. Yeah, <laughs> much more obvious. Okay. Yeah, and the drug is... It's still spelled like the Swedish counterpart, but just... Still way different to the, towards the other word. Okay, I was being dumb. We, we can get air from the air bubbles. But of course, we'll need to catch them. Oh. Okay, that pushes us out here near the water wheel. Okay. We didn't explore here much further. Oh! If I forget something I think I discovered during last Ori stream and forgot then. Whoops! Has been confirmed! Okay. Uh, okay. Here. I showed you the gift. <laughs> so I think okay. the hoof spot is easy to miss unless you are extremely close off and notice how he moves. Like it's a very hoof like movement. And someone made a gift of him, and lo and behold, the gifts he has hooves. And the way of the movements of the legs that could just as well be. Uh, pause, because in that I believe cats and goats have a similar leg structure. 
Oh. I might just be completely talking out of my ass. Uh, what was the uh, point? That similar but different enough if you take a proper look at it. Ah, uh, it was just for air. I, I, I would fully need to see uh, cat and goats walk next to each other to uh, see if I do this. I think there is a slight difference. Is this... Is this next to the... Okay, we are near the, the water, uh, near the mill. We are in a different area. Maybe that they, this is connected to it? Perhaps. Or is this on its own? It, it, can, can I take up the map again? Now go to the windmill, yeah? yeah is it right does it look like it has eyes? <laughs> a bit, like a, because a, of the doors? Yeah, but it looks like a slimy pie with many eyes and mouths. Oh, wait, just it, looking grumpy. It's like, it, the mill is in the background there. This one is being fed separately. Okay. Nice to know. Ooh. Ooh, 3 Wait, it... Hmm. What kind of tree is that? No clue. It's an Ori tree. Uh, no, no, we know we already know how the Ori tree looks like. Let's see. Okay, can we get up to there? Nope. Almost. Probably get onto there with one of the long ones. There. Yep. There we go. There is something over there. But unless we get triple jump, we can't get to that. So for now. There we go. When the willow's light shattered, the strength of the forest fell here. Okay, its presence kept these pools safe from the decay, but we must find it soon, Ori. Its light will not last. Okay. Now we use a bit of a refill. Let's see. Yeah, this this area looks a lot better than the previous places we've been, huh? Yeah. Damn gorgeous. Then again, it's it's an easy pick between decayed forest and <laughs> you know, or decaying marshes and just petrified woods. Yeah, you get uh, a place that actually looks normal and better. Yeah, and also, are, were those carnivorous seaweed? Yeah, I think some sort of mutated clams or something. Have you seen Quallock? I heard he came to the Luma, uh, to the Luma pools. But I can't find him. He is bigger here than I remember. Quallock is wise. I need his advice. If you find him, could you let me know? Okay. So he is actively working to look around as well. Yeah. Hell. What? Some sort of shrimp? I can't swim. Hmm. Land shrimp? Land crab? A barber? Okay, let's just keep spitting bubbles. Okay, I see what we need to do. We need to get across by bouncing off of the bubbles. Spitting up. Do you mean blowing bubbles? Close enough. Let's see. There is a bit of a small gap. Okay. That, that was... Bad idea if this use. Just take another hit. Let's see. Now there is a passage here, but it's sealed off, so we need to go find a mechanism.
Probably should have shot that thing first. Yeah, oh, also... Fulon might indeed be a giant toad and not a frog. Yes. Yeah, toad is more likely since frogs have uh, different kinds of legs. Yeah, I think toads has one more finger or less. And I think also only toads have those bumps around the eyes and behind the eyes. Okay. Like, sure, there are also frogs that have some special eyebrows, but not bumps. Yep. Okay. This time we can just do it like this. Let's see. Okay, these things just explode after a second shot anyways, even though we don't actively kill them. But, hmm. I can't really think of too much to say at the moment. This place is just fucking pretty. Yeah. I guess these are willows. Hmm. I don't think willow... Aren't, aren't willows supposed to have white on their on their barks or something? Or white and cracks or something? Bad. Uh, you mean black and white with uh, black stri uh, stripes? Yeah, something like that, I believe. Uh, uh, that's birch. Birch. Yeah, yeah, birch. Yeah, why was I thinking willow? <laughs> Um, hmm. Yeah, we, we look trees are those with the long, long hang. They, 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 they trees that almost look like they have long hair in a way. Okay. Let's see. There's something underneath there, but we're going to need to break that open, most likely. Uh, hmm. I doubt we can get that. Nope. Hmm. We can't get through here. Okay. <laughs> Living torpedoes now. Okay. And what are you? Oh. It's one of those air. Th it's one of those bubble uh, things, but as a starfish, basically, yeah, <laughs> blocking it. <clears throat> there we go. And there is. Okay, we should be able to destroy that from the backside. So. But yeah, take that out of context. Use flap. What? Oh, oh, blow up uh, six away with a gust of wind. Okay, that, that makes sense. Oh, it's a messy. Oh, flapping his arms like a bird. I know why it's saying that. Because we can move these bubbles with these. Ooh. Uh, but that doesn't give us much use if we can't reach them still. Hmm. Oh, we, we you need to, to do it in time. There we go. Yeah, but oh, we yeah, still man. can't reach. Hmm. Okay. What are we missing? Or wait, we oh, can't get a blue. In... Oh, it was to do it in the other direction, or or no, you could do it just fine. That's what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to race it. I forgot to check if this actually loops back or not. Oh, that makes sense. There we go. And now we use this. There. Hello, talk. The fish are biting, and not just a bait. Risk lives and wing to catch one. Oh, no, meme. Emagon, Inaj. 
Same we can't uh, <clears throat> same we can't all be like those underwater flowers, huh? They retract at the slightest touch, we're never. <laughs> if only my tail feathers could do that, fishing would be a lot less painful. Bah. Were you using your ass for bait? Let's have a look around. Oh. Okay, there's a warp point here. But it's flooded. Hmm. Hmm. But I do not use feathers as uh, to build the uh, fishing flies, but. Yeah. As a map maker, on the other side of a barricade. Let's see. Okay. Hmm. Dude. Okay. What are we to do here then with all of this? That one, but we can't go back. Does that stay open long enough? Yes, it stays open for quite a while. And okay, that retracts all of them. There we go. That unfloods the area. And now we can get to the shrine. Okay. Now we got a save point. But that is still blocked. So, is there anything hidden here? Can't break that ourselves. Then we'll just have to check down here for anything. Uh, oh. Okay, we can't use our weapons underwater. Okay. And that's the third time that Corey drowns now. Okay, yeah, we have to be careful in that area. We won't be getting extra air. There we go. Okay, so we, we need to use those living torpedoes to break open stuff like that. And, well, there's an ore over here, so might as well. We'll notice a shard here. And also the blockade. It's an Ultra Bash. Bash deals Ooh. damage. Okay. Hmm. We'll really need to see if there is a way to get more of those equipped at a time. There we go. And yeah, now we have a shortcut open. Just a little bit extra air, just to be safe. I, I think I know what those might be. Uh, what then? Something horrifying. Should to I even ask to know? The, the purified lampreys. Okay. Uh, you, you know what a lamprey is, right? I know I've heard of them, but I... Oop. Okay, more of these shrimp. Facing the wrong way. Yeah, but what is a lamprey then? Well, Pazorov is a fish that behaves like a leech. Okay. And basically the mouth looks like a suction cup with many, many, many Bruce of teeth. Oh, those things. Basically yeah. oversized uh, leeches. Yeah. Just, they look like some more terrifying than a leech. Like, if you compare them to a leech, Lamprey is basically... I think actually Lampreys have get, it being very much a nightmare for you for many people. Okay, Especially when they see what they do to fish. 
So basically, do not Google if you don't want nightmares. Uh, yeah, I can say this. It, it's really easy to see if a shark or dolphin or a whale had had lampreys on them. For they had taken ow. circular chunks out of them. I should have seen that trap coming. But yeah, I can say, look them up if you want to make a terrifying water creature. And I shoot it, I draw something that looks like a lamp tray with bat wings. Okay. Uh, uh, let's see, those things must confess, be around here somewhere. What would you do if you saw something like that? Uh, kill it, kill it, kill it. <laughs> Okay, we took some hits there. We're luckily alive. Let's see. How... I'm guessing we can get to that using one of these. Not those. These. And I just remembered. I think I only remember this because we talked about Pirates Caribbean earlier today. There we go. Hmm? One of Davy Ewan's crewmen had a lamprey head. Uh, I looked away for just a bit to focus on Rakia, but what the fuck just killed us there? I missed that too! I looked at you! Okay, take two. Yeah, we... We, wait, we need to wait for this thing to jump out for a second. It. There. It's smart enough to avoid the traps. Oop. And just... <laughs> okay, so it would torpedo itself even if we weren't the one launching it. Quickly, we're running out of air. Yep. Ow. Too late for the draw there. Explosive lamprey? Hmm. I, I, I think if it were mutated lampreys, they would probably be even worse than just this. Yeah, it is hard to get a proper look what it is. Hold on, did I oh, just... Oh, I... We launched it back into the water, so it basically came back with a vengeance. Oh, okay. Okay. I would it spat at you. Uh, it, it certainly did that despite us. Wait. There. It's one of the damn slugs! Could be, and here's There's our map maker. Manoj. Let's see. And the slugs are bigger, I'm pretty sure. <clears throat> Hello there, inter intrepid explorer. <laughs> Elite, your turn. Name. Have you ever seen this many colors in one place? Incredible, isn't it? Jin Yellow! I'll let you in on a trade secret. This is why I come for all my ink. The corals make amazing reds, you know. And yeah, let's buy that. Much obliged. Just pulls it out of the background. And that's... Okay, that's quite an area to go. Hmm. Anything more to say, actually? This is the place, my friend. The last remaining source of vitality in these beleaguered wilds. Mm -hmm. I will. Without the water that flows from these pools, the land would wither, and that mill you were started would sit silent once more. Eh, he need. Places like these, it's important to protect. And the map. He's right on both cases, actually. Before I go... Oh, yeah. There we go. Okay, dodge the trap again, and then we can finally move on. We can get, we can try and get that shard some other time. Yeah, and as for, for this slug thing, it could be a 
underwater variant. Maybe, yeah. Do they come from some sort of plant? Oh, hello there. You look a lot better under better lighting. <laughs> Squeeze his fat ass for that. Okay, might as well give chase. Let's see. Who has built all of Actually, yep. Ow. I keep falling for those things. Power. I'm pretty sure we can get up there. Yep. Be fine. Okay, a mysterious seed. It glows dimly. Perhaps someone knows what sort of seed it is. That's the second of those we found, I believe. Hmm. Pardon? <laughs> that was audible. Yeah. Was only my. Matter of time, before you do it as well. So you only done it today yourself. True. However, uh, you did it before the stream started, and I, I had to ask, what the heck did you, you eat? Um, what did I eat? Yeah, for it was a curious long burp. And there goes over I, again. I, I know when I heard that, I thought, all right, his burp. Wait, what the heck? Is he alright? Do we need some sort of a speed power to get through that area? Because we can dodge one of those uh, blocks, but not two. And again, getting my buttons confused. I've, I've been needing to do the uh, two buttons on. Uh, you know, two fingers on the shoulder buttons each uh, a lot more now. Wait, is this how you're. Yeah, because uh, I, I've been playing a lot of yeah, Lens of Zelda Tears the Kingdom lately. And yeah, they want you to have your middle fingers on the triggers and your pointer fingers on the shoulder buttons a lot as well. And so yeah, I've been getting more... I've been doing that more and more now. Okay. I, we need something to get through that. And we obviously do not have it, I think. Yeah. That's oh, the only one that way is that way. Don't forget us, we own that game. My mother is seriously considering to buy a Nintendo Switch to buy that new Zelda game. <laughs> oh, it's not a mis- it wouldn't be a mistake. And there are plenty of other good Switch games as well. How are Ooh, we yeah. supposed to get through this area? And they tell her it's like a console, but still like a uh, Game Boy as well. Yeah, it's a- it's a tablet game. Uh, it's a ca tablet console. Is there something hidden here? Or I'm not something? sure if I would call it that for... It's more diverse than a tablet, since you can hold it like a game console, but you can also plug it in so you can play it on a TV and, and a controller regularly as well. What the hell am I missing here? Like, we cannot dodge all of those in one go. We can't dash underwater. We can only go this fast. Be missing a skill, perhaps? Uh... What are those? Mm. I don't see any obvious secret areas here. Or even hidden areas that would likely have air bubbles. What the hell are we supposed to do here? What are we missing? Did I just turn into a sheep? <laughs> yes. Let's see, maybe I'm something over my here. Captain. Hmm.
Maybe I am just doing something stupid, but let's go look around the area some more. Maybe we are missing a shard we should be getting. Oh, hello. Shh, do not move. He will scare fish. They are sneaky. If I had a net, but mine is broken. If I had string, you don't have string, do you? Or even better, a net? No? Oh. Okay, we found an another step in the trading quest then. But nothing to help us at the moment. Hmm. Should we tell, tell them that there's no fish over there? Hmm. You know, we can leave them be for now. Otherwise, it's going to be a pain in the neck to find them later. But, yeah, yeah. Tears of the Kingdom adds in a ton of quality of life improvements over Breath of the Wild and just the entire new construction system as well. I think we might need that shard. It might have something that we actually need here. First off, resupply. And hopefully this time we can do this without getting slapped in the back of the head by this thing. After we get up there. Yeah. Ooh. Not enough. And then it came back anyways. Ooh. Actually, could I just... Could I just bash off of it, off of it again? Okay, up. Note that it crashed this time. Hmm. Probably overthinking it a little bit with this, but... There we go. And not this time. Now, what was that that we got? If there was anything... Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> it got delayed because we got hurt. Energy harvest. Okay. <laughs> Enemies will drop more energy orbs. It's nice and all, but not something we actually have a use or need for at the moment. Yeah, and this is just a racing shrine. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we're not gonna bother with racing. What the hell are we supposed to do? There's no pro there's no projectile to bash off to get through that quickly. And I very much doubt that we can just bash a projectile from that thing through here. Yeah, it says it holds to swim faster, but that's what I'm doing. It. Even that is not enough. Uh, what are we, we, we are missing something here. Do I need to keep pressing it or just... Oh. Uh. Okay. <laughs> what? The game just glitched there. Yeah, what the heck? Not today, Speed McGee! This is as fast as Orvi will go here. We just don't have enough speed. We are missing something here. Let's... Do we have anything here to speed up speed? Movement. Let's see, reckless, ultra bash, ultra grapple. Hmm. Let's try it one more time and then we'll head to a different area. But this this doesn't feel correct. I... Come on. Try to come up that one. Pardon? 
Yeah, that one wasn't hurt this time. Yeah. Alright, my mic did react to it, so I guess it got extremely low. But enough for the mic to register. Hmm. Like, this doesn't feel correct with the game's design philosophy. Like, we should be able to be able you know, get through there. Uh hmm. Yeah, so there's an area above something here. here. That bubble thing isn't blowing. Can't break this. Um... No, I don't think that would do anything if we blow those in here. Can, we can't use this underwater. What are we missing? There's one thing I can think of, sort of. Oh? But this is a long shot, literally and figuratively. And... Okay, oh, but... What? Okay? So, okay, we know now that they blow up after a certain distance. And I just noticed this here. So, we need to clear up that uh, bubble thing there. And that is how we're supposed to be getting around them. Okay. Yeah, I, I, com I completely overlooked that, so I'll... Yeah. I'll take the blame on that one. I will take the blame as well. Five is that for. I so I want to say, is that meant uh, spitter are meant to be there for some reason? But they usually around if you can use them for something. Oh, they've been around for just enemies as well. Let's see. What the heck was that? Can we get extra heights this way? Hmm. Yeah, I think you have uh, timed it a bit badly. Yeah, now we're losing. <laughs> Yeah, right. it seems the bigger the bubble, the more bounce you get. Uh, not sure. Let's... Mm. Let's first off... Let's try to get on the other side of the rock there, if we can cling to it. Yes. Okay, come on, Ori. There we go. Yes. Wait, weren't we able to stand on them? No, they pop instantly, and no, we cannot. <clears throat> we can't. Uh, cling to that side, so we'll have to do with this. Are we... Can we get extra height this way? No, we're at the same height. Hmm. This one is going to be tricky, because we have just a really small window of time to actually launch onto that, if we even get in the right position anyways. There. Yep. Yep. You... Okay. 
Maybe we can stand on them? What? They've burst every other time there. But you were crashing into them the other times. Now, we, even when even when floating with the feather, basically meaning we'd have the, the softest landing we could, they were still popping. Hmm. But there's another one that probably make it there. And one of those. There we go. Now, before we actually follow where that goes, let's go look around a little bit more. Oh, hello. Okay, a keystone and an obvious way of getting shot in the face with a living torpedo. I do believe actual torpedoes do spin like that. To a uh, base, or some do. Yeah, to, and I just. To keep stable. Yeah, and I just noticed. What if it's not a lamprey? What then? Some sort of squid? Yeah. Then again, this world, this world has already seen plenty of odd uh, beasts around. Okay, yeah, like climb the, up to that. Oh, brother! I can't believe I can call those that name. Squirt uh, tail. Squirtles. Uh, What's that? Ow! Squirtles. What? Yeah, squirtles, like the Pokemon. <laughs> you, are you were you talking about those uh, scorpion things or something? Yeah, the scorpion ones. I call those a uh, squirt tail. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds very much like Squirtle. Or like you're oh, trying to say Squirtle. I get a scorpion? Let's just go with scorpion or something like that. Squirt scorpion? Not helping. <laughs> Bombardier scorpion? Okay, now that race is active. That's the end point of it. Okay. Uh, no interest in that. Or did that activate it as a race? No, this is... Oh, this is the finish. Okay. Now I get it with those things. Still not going to do them. Let's see. How many do we need? Four. Okay, and we have four. Uh, let's continue looking a little bit. Can't go further here. There, and now we can move on. Oh, hello. Oh, sorry if that was audible. Just a loud motor passing by. Swim dash. Okay, now we can get through that place. I told you. I told you we're missing a skill. But did you believe me? No. I, I didn't say that. <laughs> we were just missing okay, the thing. <laughs> yeah, okay, so that, I went a little bit too bored with that one. And we can actually damage things with this as well. So we don't need those... Uh, more things to clean these out. Yeah, 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 just watch out for the clams. Or muscles. Mm. Oh, Still don't oh, actually know or care much what the difference is. Yeah, just don't bust into them. But then we yeah. just be, it sounds like a quick way to get, well, numb. Yeah, a headache <laughs> and eaten. Go. Ow. You, you know what they remind me? Hmm? They look like an underwater version of that clone from uh, Ketchup of Horror. 
No. Cecil, I believe the name was. Yeah, I want to see that movie sometime. Okay. That is how we can go back here. But no, this is a new area. Let's see. There's something this way as well. And I just remembered that Cloud had his own cartoon series on Nickelodeon. <laughs> yeah. This makes you kind of go, what? Yeah. I recall there. was it so many that he arrived and felt, what is going on? Ow. And one of the. I think I, there's one episode I remember really clearly on some part that he stole a sapling, went to an American football field, and tried to make the grass grow. Okay. Probably is he hadn't realized all oh, the football grass was plastic. <laughs> so That's... that plan backfired when he tried to start a revolution or something. Uh, 90s uh, cartoons uh, were weird. Yeah. Bloody heck, let's be honest. Some 20 ones as well. Yeah. And, uh, Hidden Mickey? Since see one circle big, <laughs> one circle big, two big circles make mouse ear. I forgot that was a thing. I don't think I saw any of that. But I do, I'm glad that we're having, uh, like, there was a period I feel like I can see why people were more interested in anime than cartoons at one point. But I don't feel like we're finally yep. in a state where cartoons and anime are both good again. Or rather, mm. both can be enjoyed by older audience, at least. Alright. Okay. Dash. There we go. Okay, did that do something? Oh. My pint is empty. Ooh, ow. Well, if my pint is empty, that's it. That means I can shoot straight. <laughs> Why did I do an accent? <laughs> did I seriously try to mimic at war? Yep. Isn't that what your entire lifestyle is about? I beg your pardon? Ow. Okay, that, comp that actually complicates things a little bit. With opening up that shortcut, can I? That actually, was a hit. No, that actually hits. I kind of, well, I probably would enjoy living in a basement if it means the basement would be cooler than an upper floor. Oh. Okay, a bit late to grow up that now. Hmm. Okay, now we know that there's a life cell there that we can go get if we can get back up there, or... Can we long shot? Nope. Not enough distance by far. Okay, what are you for then? Other than just being a ow bastard? Okay... Well, now we're here. Now we can. F now we can pass by the the, the boulder trap. Uh, hello and goodbye. Whoop. Oh, here we go again. Yeah. yeah th these are some weird crabs. Ooh. Some sort of mutated the... fish. Corrupted the fish. fish uh, yeah. What's next? You did the spider crabs or coconut? 
I know people find spider crabs creepy, but I actually find the coconut crabs more scary. And what's the major difference then? Uh, coconut crabs can uh, easily cut off your hand. Can't any mid ooh, can't any big crab do that already? Not easily, and not it. It's to be other crabs. Probably not do it because you would not be in contact with them likely. But coconut crabs, they are on land. Okay. So they basically call it that because their claws can crack coconuts. They actually do that. Hence they need the coconut. E? They they are omnivores. They eat coconuts and anything dead, but also including pets. Yeah, that's obviously going to be an issue. Oh yeah, for apparently it has been known for them to kill cats and dogs to eat them. Okay, one more health cell. I think they even I think I saw a show where you said that it's common to that uh, they warn people to keep their kittens indoors. It, kittens, it, it with kittens is advised to always keep them indoors, anyways. Yeah, Until but also all the cats. Just, just keep your animals away. Just keep them in your yard or something, but never let them run loose on the beach and such. For they, yeah. those same crabs will be in the on the beach and the forest on the beach. But they says again, they often the coconuts. So the coconuts will be on the ground or in the trees, and they can climb. Now I want a, a version of that song with uh, I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts, but then Krabby. Like, mis like use that Mr. Krabs voice AI or something. I misheard it there. What did you hear? I heard Krabby. <laughs> well, Krabbies are very Krabby. Yeah, but... The Grabby and a bunch of lovely coconuts. You, you, I think you, I don't need to explain out of, out of context that would sound. Uh, very, but you're the one going with, with the mind going there first. Because I heard, already heard people do the pervert version of it. it, it okay, something wrong with the prologue. Uh, Okay, the frog's hypnotized. What? Okay. Oh. You again. So, I may have uh, thing confirmed that the other thing we have that is actually a shrieker. Yes, shriek is the bird. This is this is something else. Yeah, just what I mean is the thing that the, the bird was obviously dead, but it was something inside the bird's corpse controlling it. You're yeah, getting close. What else is this is what is controlling the shriek. One hit us there. Uh, okay. A rock, I think. Run, run. Run as fast as you can. You may not be a stranger man, man, but you should still freaking run. But, uh, again, as I say, I think that is the same species that is controlled in the Shriek. Uh, uh, you, well, up, you, up, and If you away. remember, the Shriek is covered with tentacles as well. We'll have to see when we find her next. Yeah. We don't have much time. I should have known it was not the last time we solved that damn thing.
And nowhere to run. Yeah. Now we have an actual boss fight with this thing as it's possessing Qualak. Yep. Okay, I know some I know some people say their abs are lit, but not lit enough to cause fire burns. <laughs> like that. I'm sure you need hot abs. Wait. It's his tongue! It's ignites the fire! Okay, he's spilling some lit bars then. Okay. Wait. Can it be California Reaper Peppers? Hey, Bini T? Quickly grab that. Oh, wait. Nope. They might have swallowed a whole no. bottle of the bomb. Now, okay, when the arms go in the ground, keep moving. And how did that not hit? Okay, now he is spitting lit bars. Or lit bombs. Ow. Oh, grabby. This thing isn't grabby, but it is grabby. Oh. Come on, you old frog. Snap out of it. Okay, that can't be good for your digestion. Wait, does that mean that that thing is also responsible for those torpedo things? And that totally should have hit me. It might be. What are you planning? Oh, that's what you're planning. Doesn't work as well when we have a lot more mobility. Ow. I hope you said rocks and not coconuts. And now it's only one You probably oh. can't eat uh, coconut crabs. Oh, come on! I, I lost track of how much damage we'd taken! Let me out. Yeah, I, I have a feeling that whatever this thing is, it's definitely a sort of parasite. We can't hurt it by attacking its hands. Oddly handy tentacles. I'll take that. Ow. Okay, back with this. Good, ow. Come on, break free, old frog. Okay. 
running into things. Oh, wait. We have no solid ground, so... Yeah, we can't heal. Okay, that is going to complicate things a little bit. Ow. Uh. Especially if I'm going to fly into it. Him. Okay, yeah. We need to be healed up as much as possible during this phase. Because we're not going to... Ow. That didn't actually hit, but almost. We're not going to be able to heal in the next phase. Those show where, how, where they're going to land. He, he got infected quick. It was what five, ten minutes since we'd seen him. Yeah. Able to reach the shoot the damn thing. It's using Quarlock as a shield. Yeah. Ow. Quick. There we go. I really was surprised that this is the thing the thing or this bag does. They swim around and look for the strongest thing to control. Oh. Wait, the arrows actually take energy? I actually missed that. Oh, oh! It's blocking the water surface with one of its angles. Okay. And yeah, the arrows do cost a little bit of energy. Makes sense, of course, otherwise people are just going to fully abuse them. Ow. Yeah. Okay, halfway. Hope there isn't a third phase. Oh, we are on our last bit. Okay, not falling for this trick again. As it's or as its tentacle arm janks up and down. <laughs> of all things, for we drowned this time. Okay. Why? <laughs> Keep forgetting that's what the first thing he does is when he breaks the floor. Or pass the floor. Ow. Don't think ow. I don't think we can bash those boulders. get some, some hits in there, but we will have to dodge his own attacks as he does that. Yeah. Yeah. If 
about time for oop phase change. Mm, he's going for it. Yep. Quick. Oop. Okay, the other one explodes. Oop. Ow. That one is dangerous since it leaves a, a haze in the water. Oop. Okay, now he's doubling up. Ow. Wait, I want to jump. Throw those rocks at him. I don't think we can bash them. But we can try. dash into him. That probably should have hit me actually there. Well, lucky at least he doesn't try to combo that with this. Spit that up for a bit. He's moved on from spitting hot bars to sick bars. Nope. Wait. Did we just cancel him out of one of his attacks somehow? Maybe? Those from across. Keep an eye on our oxygen. Oh, okay. If he goes underwater, uh, that's not dive into the spikes. If we get out of the water fast enough, he will cancel the attack. Oop, air. Ow. I missed one of the rocks there. Oop. Well, at least there's no poison or rocks. Okay, he's... I can't tell if he's speeding up with that. Don't want to know. Oop. Oh, come on! I accidentally dashed into him. We were so close, weren't we? Yep. Yeah, I've also seen the proper the, the, the health bar due to pixelations, but still. Not a... I'm... Let me out. Need to keep a. Uh, understand his moves. Spit. Yep. It's Rear's turn to sender. That's the most single damaging attack that we can do, do by countering it. Oh. Oh. 
heal. There we go. Actually, let me change things up a little bit. to try to hammer on him. For that we need to actually get close as well. Okay, he will try to move through that attack sometimes even if we are already above water. I think that's the perfect time for us to attack since those tentacles can't reach in the center. Yeah, I just watch out for uh, water forms. Yep, older. Yeah, he, he will. Ow. Okay, we, yeah, we can take this. So much easier now. It is risky to get near him. Okay, hurt ourselves as well there, but oh well. Okay, let's not drown. Now the arrows. Deal only a small amount of damage compared to how quickly we can slash out like that. Okay, there's nothing you can do right now. Come on, try your tentacle trick again. Not that one. Ew. Yeah, that's the one. That one basically gives us free hits. Yep. There. control of the toad at the moment yeah so we need to quickly chase after him yep, yep. and actually grab onto the vines and i had to start to zoom out there we go There we go. Quarlock is no more. 
but we are one step closer to saving you know, this land and crew with it, hopefully. Rest in peace, Vorlock. Rest in peace. At least you died a bit more... More like a warrior than the toads in my old village. Okay. Uh, let's... let's say this. When you were walking to school after rain, you may see something nasty on the road. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I, I grew dull over to it. And not maybe we could draw artwork or something inspire it, but also at the same time, I can see people just puking at the sight. Yeah. And I don't, I'm see. not going to give the description of what happens. Yeah. Toads and the cars. You can put one and one together. Uh, bikes as well. I think some have encountered with bikes and motorbikes as well. Okay, we can go down there. We can probably do their family reunion as well when we're close. Uh, let's see. Uh, shouldn't we be able to warp to that? Or, oh, wait, green water. Of course, we can't warp then. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. What happened? I, I blinked and missed. This here, very touchy coral. I'm going to be uh, polite and call it that instead of whatever the hell it likely is. Something in here. Okay, it's more bundle. like more. Hmm. Oh, great. Of course, I had to say that I just remember it's a random fact about Onikos. I learned today from a little bit of clip of a video that I didn't watch. Okay. I'm not sure it's stream, uh, Twitch friendly to say. Ah. Let's go give that Moki the bad news. Hmm. Put down the save. And let's see. Yeah. Put the next one over. Hold on, can we? There. Can we bash off of those spikes? No. Oh. Okay, they're just going to explode after one shot anyways. Out of here. You get out of my way. Warlock is gone? What will we Moki do? Great guardian, great teacher, both mossy and wise. I must pay my respects, but I am not strong enough to travel back to the marsh. This amulet. Warlord gave it to me long ago. Could you bring it to his pool in the hollow? One's given by Quarlock to a little Moki to inspire a little courage. Okay. I, I've started to think they are wizards or magicians. And it's also along the way. Okay. Uh, 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 think about it. It would make sense if they are magicians. Uh, which exactly? Uh, the Moki says to keep pulling things behind the ears. <laughs> Maybe. You know, like, uh, when they pull out the coin card. Uh, coin card? What? <laughs> coin trick. Coin trick. Yes. Coin trick from behind your ear. Okay. No real need.
need for that trick anymore. That's still useful. And here. There. Okay. Then we deliver the amulet, and then we go into the shrine. that altar. Ah, here. Yeah, they work quick. There we go. That's a big amulet. <laughs> Rest in peace, Frolock. He's probably one of the very few frogs I like, besides those in Amphibia. Okay, uh, we can go this way. What is there? Actually, now that we can dash out of the water. There we go. Another energy cell. Up. And one fart bag exploded in the face. <laughs> I'm gonna stand over here until you stop stinking. <laughs> There. Okay. Up above. Okay. Uh, did not expect to get machine gunned. Okay. Did they accidentally kill each other? Looks like it. Uh, did I need to... They have to get up there. Uh, let's see. Is that thing going to respawn? Hmm. There is no wall to climb on there. We need to get a certain distance before they respawn. Looks like it. Okay. Let's go a little bit further. Okay, and let's try it now. Probably respawn the fart bags as well. No. Okay. That is creepy. What, the, the petrified Moki? Uh, there, there's a, something in the back that looked like a someone was like a giant Grim Reaper or something. Oh, that thing? Yeah, I think that's a big hut. You? Yeah, but it looks like someone in a coat of very long legs. Long, long, long legs. Okay. How are we supposed to get there? This thing doesn't fire fast enough to get off, to get up just by that. It does have just a, a rapid fire like that. Can't even bounce. Can we bounce off a few or is it going to hurt? Okay, it didn't seem like a bounce. <laughs> We don't have a... Maybe that's other opening on the other side goes around. First off, though. Yeah, new enemy. Almost. Or new enemy type of that, at least. Or not type of that enemy. Boy. Yep, yep. Just too late. And of course, that thing dives in <laughs> for a snack afterwards. Well, they do seem quite hungry. 
Goody. Okay. This should work. Ooh, hello. Ah, light bearer. Your kind is not welcome here, my garden. When the trees needed you most, yes, you were gone. <laughs> now look, look. My garden is all but dead, see? Old stone, bitter dust. <laughs> Only one tree lingers. Ah, even she is not whole. <laughs> Leave this dying place, yes, as your kind did before. And let us yes, you can bring my lost daughter healing. Bear her poisoned limb, light bearer. Find the healer of nature. Write what your kind has wronged. Okay, yeah, this this tree is half petrified. Okay. Lifeless yeah. branch. Gray and lifeless. Okay. Someone who knows about plants. And this is the place. For the Moki's family. Oh no. These Mokis stay too long in the decay. They are turned to stone, along with the rest of these woods. Petrified doll. Once an object of affection, now it's stiff and gray. Now we know what happens to those that stay in decay or afflicted too long. We have enough ore for anything more. Was it you? No. Next bunch over. You. Spirits, have you found my family in the silent woods? Is that my pup's doll? But it is stone. No. I. I must go home. Guy. Get all of this ready for them. Yeah, uh, it, it's a wonderful, beautiful game, but it has both warmth and sadness. Stone, stone cold, cold. Come here, here. My customers whisper of your friends. They say that you are trying to save her. Ah, oh, him. Ah, oh. ah. Oh. I had a friend who once too, you see, before I had only my shining shards. Oh yes, I admire your strengths, and I rem will remember your name, Ori. Let's see. I don't think we have too much use for these at the moment, except for this. And might as well... There we go, 30% less damage. Should be able to help us quite a bit. Uh, anything of use that we can buy? Energy, life, maybe sometime. But we definitely want that. Hmm. Yeah, that triple jump would make getting, like, getting around a hell of a lot easier. And would it make some boss fights is you? Hello. I came here from the marsh because I heard the glades were beautiful. Oh, you again. We've, we've talked with you before. 
You want a hat. Let's see. A hat for a brat. No, he's a furry rat. Maybe not a cat. Uh, but at least he's not fat. But that's the that that's the end of that. Well, at least they're not uh, running around at night dressed like a bat. Yes, people, I made a Batman joke of a monkey. Oh, good God. Imagine that sight, a monkey dressing up as a Batman. A uh, monkey man. Bat monkey. Uh, don't be a zombie alarm, Bat monkey, yeah. yeah. Let's go back to the spirit edge, put that top. Uh, I will have that move for it. But I wonder how hey, would the Joker be? There, I accidentally messed up my the ones we had that I had equipped. Let's see. Okay, so it's not a pet to fight spy, it was a spider statue. Yeah. And uh, I think it should be more than clear, but uh, arachnophobia warning from here on. Because this place is absolutely infested. Out of that. And yeah, there are all sorts of bugs stuck in webbing here. Uh, seems that his corpse is keeping that spiky fluffy thing down. Okay. Uh, yeah, putting this back on. Probably that's probably just going to be out ow, ow, a permanent fixture. And yeah, these are all still alive. Yep. Return to sender. Yep. Wrong address. There we go. Okay, quick heal. Just take that back, you farting slug. Whatever the hell you are. Now you're spitting, okay? So that thing is like the Kazooie from Banjo Kazooie. Goes out both ways, apparently. Ooh. Ooh, light. Oh, the spider looks a bit bath like. Probably that to make it less arachnophobia like. 
Hit, I don't think it, you, it'd be less arachnophobic like if it's a bad spider. I think that's just a new nightmare for you. This is where the eyes of the forest sank in the sightless night. These woods were always dark, but the decay made their darkness deeper and more dangerous. Okay. Can we... Oh, hello. Firefly in some sort of amber. And here's the spiders. They made a Jurassic Park reference here, just replace mosquito with a firefly inside an amber. Apparently. Nope, that's but they somehow still alive. Some insect's leg. Okay, let's just bring it back out again. function like yeah those functions like platforms okay so up up come here uh, we need one more and those are some big bug wings uh, ow, ow. there get some some big bugs just in general. Okay, quickly. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if the light manages to encroach, that we are done for. I think you phrase that. When the light encro I think you mean the, no, when, when the, the darkness, darkness encroaches to yeah. completely. For the light has only already encroached us. Okay, back to you. There, now we have two. The, my controller even rumbles as the light fades away. Oop. At least we now know that those are up there. Uh, oh, you again. Uh, that, yeah, point proven. Okay. Swallowed by a dark abyss. Careful not to fall or get too far away. Uh, quick. Yep. Oh, come on. Was that a lightning? No, the we didn't get any light from uh, the thing we pulled. Yeah, but it looked like a lightning flashed along the walls. Now that was the the. The whip, I think. I don't think the whip makes it that massive, but I guess it could also be, also be a bit of a lightning effect bug. Okay, at least they're a little bit less Come on. annoying here. Because they don't seem to fire off as fast. Quick. There's another of the hanging ones waiting for us. Not that way. That lost. 
spidling bastards. Okay. There. Something pulsing on the upper left. Okay, let's not stick around that. Aren't you supposed to be stuck in webs? Oh, there's a nest of the bastards. I'm not sure why Wasp would make a nest in a spider's lair. Yeah, good question, but then again, probably how the spider survives down here. Unless they eat each other as well. Can't keep enough air time. There we go. Probably could have done that better with by just bashing it with uh, the hammer, but I will. Uh, let's see. Put you down. Up. Yep. Ah. Ow. Does that mean we have to... Yes. Okay. You know what? Screw all of you nosy jackasses. There. And ow. Ow. Come on. <laughs> and we backflip into that. <laughs> oh, God, you gods. And goddesses. That. Okay. Yep. And now I have a song stuck in my head again. You. Which uh, one then? I'm sure many people remember this song, uh, Mosquito Parasito. Uh, I think from uh, from Loco Loco. I think so. Yeah, they made only like two songs, I believe, and the one was uh, that song where that that hot chili sauce or some you know, hot chili song or something. I think maybe more it like burns, this burns, one. burns. Yeah, I he also made one that um, put some uh, hot lady. I don't remember the animation for the music videos were rough. Yeah, I, I'd say it gives it some <laughs> rather per it gives it a uh, personality. Yeah, uh, just going to ignore was, you. It was early on with the move when people started to use a bit more 3D for some things. Yeah. It was not in the same quality as Crazy Frog, for example. Here. Uh, but I think I can remember a bit of the lyrics. Mosquito, parasito, yeah, and yeah, something about I kill you. Yeah, I'd like killing the mosquitoes. Yeah. Or at least the one that's singing. Yeah, there's two, a pair of them, I believe. Oh, right. I used to listen to that, but I thought it, it, it was a little bit funny. But I can also see it getting annoying. Okay, now we have a save station here. Or at least a warp station. Where do you go? Wait, warp? Yeah, that is what we are. Like, it says it literally there. Yeah, why to warp? Holy. And you don't use any warp protection? Not that kind of warp. <laughs> oh, that'd be a. I think this okay. place is gruesome enough without any uh, chaos bullshit. Yeah, I don't, if, if there were to be one Chaos God as a boss, it probably would be Nurgle. Okay, is 
thing is going a bit of a long way. Okay, surprised I didn't get hurt there. And it's another gate. I can fix that. I just take this stone brick and drop it on your toe. My toe is hurt enough as is, and I don't need another one on top of that. So it has it mostly healed. Yeah, I hope it stays that way for... You will be rightfully annoyed if something actually hurts it again shortly after getting healed. Okay. There's something more up there, I think. Yeah, there's a cell fragment. Let's see how we're we on time. Alright. Yeah, ten minutes. Oh, of course, they'd have stuff move in the foreground. Yeah, we won't be able to get this wisp in the amount of time we have left, so we will have to leave that for next time. Just how many fucking bugs are there in this place? Nope, let me go grab that. You. I, I have a feeling they, that they, they have seen something like this and just took the inspiration and just went all ham with it. Oh, that one stuck. I'm not sure if I'm going to say you the term all ham in this case, more like... All chitin? What? All chitin? Since bug yes, exoskeleton is made out of chitin. Never mind that. Okay, that was just... Right. That the was the, 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 for my the path. brick on the bare pinky toe. That's the one that got stuck. That, that's the one that got hurt. Oh, what was your big toe for that? The big toe is usually the one that gets hurt the most. Hmm. Yeah, it, it it was the it just out of uh, complete outer edge of my foot that I caught the uh, stop on one of the uh, equipment uh, briefcases. That. They're shaped like briefcases. Oh, yeah, the that's stuff just that. Bad uh, luck. Yeah. Yep. The stuff that power tools and such get kept in. Did I change? Oh. No. Is there something there? Well, I guess I'm dropping the big on the big toe instead of the roll. Okay, now we made it. Wait, wait, I think I have the term now. They were just all in. Okay, there's a cell there. Okay, at least we have a checkpoint here. Ooh. Come on, I was in light there. I think you got pulled inside its hole. No, it was the darkness that killed there. Um, which way are we supposed to go here then? Are we missing something here? Can we bash off of those? If we can, it will help. We'll need to get close enough first, though. So there. Yes, we can. Okay, just need to keep going. Up. Oh, and that's... There's an obstacle there, okay. Yeah, this place is not supposed to be nice. 
We are literally in a spider's lair. More like spider prison, from how they described it. Bit of that. Now we just need to head up as much as we can. Don't eat the glowy shrooms. <laughs> yeah, we need them for light. Exactly. Don't eat. That's why you don't eat them. So if you eat them, perhaps you will glue more. Uh, what did I just smash and rust from friends when he added too much bleach on his teeth? Okay, not going to ask further. Uh, it's not that weird. Oh, well, it is weird. More of when they turn off the light, you could see his teeth in the dark. Uh, okay. Yeah, it used been, too I'm much. Pretty, I'm pretty it's sure much. bleach is not supposed to uh, light up under UV light. So yeah, it, that might have been something else. Yeah, I think the yokos they used too much. Uh, Whitening bleach. So they were so white they could glow in the dark. Yeah, that that's a better explanation than the uh, other one that would have come to mind from lighting up under UV. Actually, that's yeah, still it, it, a... it, it, it's one of those weird, stupid things that even as a kid I just went, what? Like she always found it, but what? Like, I think it's one of those jokes that, he, that goes better in a cartoon than with a live actor. Yeah. And uh, wait. I just realized that means they needed to have used a special paste to make his teeth actually glow in the dark. Okay. What have we here? Something to make our own lights? Flash. Okay, create an aura of light that damages enemies. <laughs> okay, so we are going to shine bright like a diamond. Wait, are you telling me you're gonna f flash the... Oh, what I just got over here on the table of shame. And yes, I just realized uh, uh, that I almost ma accidentally made a flash joke. Well, let's get out of here like a flash then. You mean before the cops come through you? For public indecency? <laughs> you. Wait, I just realized. Ori is already naked. Yep. You know, he could claim to be dressed in a a fine sheen of fluorescent light. He yeah, can actively we can better. Yes, that is burning through energy. We okay. can better here. We have a bit more class of a yoke. We, we were wearing fine clothes that only intelligent people can see. Okay. And yes, bonus points for anyone who gets the reference. Mm. Actually, can I surprise Hila doesn't? I know it, so I'm just not mentioning it. Spirit Surge. The more damage, the more spirit light you have. Okay. Okay. So it's one of those, uh, the more money you have, the more damage you deal. So you're gonna become a loot goblin. <laughs> yeah, we do need those <clears throat> abilities. Oh, and that's the stream timer going off. Yeah, I, I just looked over at the time <laughs> as you said that. Okay. Well, we are. Well, we are definitely going to head straight for the next uh, of the wisps or wisps. <clears throat> 
I keep saying... I keep, I'm pretty sure I keep saying it wrong, but I don't actually know. I should look Surprise, up one of those. No! Oh, oh. oh what the... uh, Okay. <laughs> Hello there, Puma Oblivion. Thank you for the raids. Uh, <laughs> we were just about to end ourselves. Uh, end the stream ourselves. Blech. Miss saying. Heck, that young uh. scare. That's not the first time that that cat jump scared us. Uh, anyways, uh, before we end it though, this is Ori and uh, yeah, we're going to send it forward. This is Ori and not the will of, not the blind forest. I keep messing. I keep swapping the back and forth. Blind now. forest. This is Ori and the Will of the Wisps, the second of the Ori games, and basically our, our main character and their adoptive sister ku they are stuck on a different island and well they need to find the wisps to try and heal this land and get the fuck back to their own islands and uh yeah we've already got two wisps we just need to find uh three more one of which is right over here in the depths of a spider's nest so yeah and as you can see <laughs> Every every inch of this game looks like this in quality. Not that everything of this game looks like it's just in a spider web covered pit. But yeah, this this is a really really good game along with the first. Okay, let's see. Uh, Puma, interesting. I do have the games. Just need the time to play them. Uh, I would definitely suggest them as a as, as a game to stream. It definitely what I'm doing now. As a it would be very interesting to see people's reactions to certain parts of it. But for now, uh, all of those backup saves got save up. And then we go look for someone to raid. So there. We head on over here. Okay, and while I close the game off, there. I'm going to pull up the browser and we go look for someone to raid. So let's have a look. Resize that so it's actually decently visible. <clears throat> then we change the screen share to the browser. Make sure that the place is muted. It is okay. And let's see, there's still a bunch of people on. So, okay, there's actually a few more, a few less than last time, it seems. Uh, da -da -da. Uh, also, yeah, I forgot. Uh, for the people raiding, I'm Captain Hillian. Over there, we have my first mate and Lieutenant Drakir. And, uh, Just Lieutenant. <laughs> I, I'm not the assistant of the sailmaster. And uh, yeah, we... I guess you would call us variety streamers. We basically stream games in a Let's Play-ish like style. Uh, games that I've played before. Games that I haven't played before. And um, yeah, just going through the games, having fun with them as much as possible. And uh, yeah, we might, be, we might be ending it now, but tomorrow we will have two streams in the afternoon uh, and, and two, one, one stream in the afternoon and one in the evening. Uh, Amsterdam time, 3 p.m. and 8 p.m. And uh, yeah, we'll have a showcase Sunday. And uh, what should we actually put in the, the open space for Saturday, Sunday evening. More Ori? Or Ori Transistor? Or Transistor. Okay, I'll leave the option to you I'm to decide. Both. Let's see then. I, I'll see what we did more of them. <laughs> Let's and see. And I think I see someone we can raid. Oh, who then? Oh. Derpidu playing Shanti and the. Uh... Seven sirens. Something. <laughs> okay, well, that's an easy decide. <laughs> Normally, I would read through some of the names. I, Hello, I am going to need to cut through this more. Party hat. <laughs> yeah, they they've been doing a they've been doing a uh, donathons. I be, I believe they've basically been doing as long as people are making donations, they extend the length of the stream. Though they will, of course, sleep in between if it goes for too long. But yeah, let's copy the name. Head on over to our place and slash raid, paste. But before, of course, before we go, of course, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. 
Uh, yeah, thank you Puma for showing up with the raids. Very much appreciate it. Uh, thank you Random Marco, even though they had to go. And yeah, thank you everyone who came with the raid and who may have been lurking or just watching this later on YouTube. Uh, like I said, tomorrow we have a Showcase Sunday number 90, I'm pretty sure. Basically, we try out some games for streams later, perhaps, and give them a yes or no. And we'll see if we start with Transistor after or just continue with Ori. That'll be up to you to decide. Or the coin flip. I will give an answer to you tomorrow. <laughs> All right, then. Uh, for now, let's start up the raids. And yeah, thank you all again for watching. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe, everyone. And watch out for giant parasite possessing giant toads. <laughs> that was a boss we fought. So uh, yeah, until next time, everyone. <laughs>